No better time than to get more organized in the beginning of a new year. We're back at City Mill hanging out with Iris, and we're going to help you declutter all that mm -hmm. mess to kick off the new year. What's the best way to start? Well, the first thing we're going to look at is your wall space. A lot of people have empty walls and everything on the floor, right? And you want to get the stuff off the floor so you have more space. And we have a couple of foolproof ways to save some space and put things on your wall. We have these wall-mounted storage bins. It has a wall mount, just two screws, put it where you want it, and these slide in. And then you can put all kinds of things. Toys, know, I'm already toys, thinking of everything that's on the ground toys, right now. Toys, cleaning things, your remote controls. Mm -hmm. We also have TV mounts. How many people have uh, things that are on cabinets and mm -hmm. you want to put it up? TV mounts are great to put on on the wall. Especially for people, most people with TVs, a lot of them have TV stands, stands which yeah. takes up a ton of space. And the stands really don't hold anything, so you're not using it to utilize other things that you could sub shove in drawers, right? We have wall mounts, and these are great too because you can just put it on your wall, you can hang things off of. We also have this great wall shelf and hamper. So you can stick it on your wall, have put towels up there, laundry, take the laundry bag out, take it to your wash and dryer and do your laundry. But it's also off the floor, so you don't have anything on the floor. There. That's right. So utilizing, being more creative and smart with the way that we utilize the wall space mm -hmm. could save you a lot of space. It can save you a lot of space. Okay, let's talk a little bit about those empty areas, maybe areas that aren't, we're not paying as much attention to. If we organize those empty areas, that could lead to good things. Oh, that would lead to a lot of <laughs> save time trying to find those keys you threw in a drawer with a whole bunch of junk, right? So we have a lot of things that you can do to utilize those drawers that nobody ever sees. One of the things we carry is this great modular stacking thing. You can put in all your flour, sugar, pasta. You don't have to have all these bags all over the place just stuck in, in your cabinets. And, and they stack on top of each other and they fit for your junk drawers. We have some great things to get rid of all the junk drawers. How many people have a junk drawer that has, I don't know, batteries, I do. keys, scissors, scissors screwdriver, all couple. the random things. And these are really great too. Helps you organize different sizes for different drawers. Kitchen junk drawers. How many places have kitchen junk drawers, you know? We have all this stuff just thrown in a drawer all together, and these actually help separate you. This, your drawer could look like this. A lot of people's drawer looks like that right <laughs> and there. And then by the end, it can look like that. Saves a lot of time and space, and it makes people happier when you can find things quickly, right? The garage is another big one, though. Yeah. So a lot of people work out in the garage. I mean, it's so much more than just people parking there. Well, What's the best way to maximize it? Try to work out in the garage, <laughs> or they try to park the car in the garage. They have no space because they've left everything on the ground. A lot of things that could go to on your garage. We have these hooks that go up on the top that you can put all of your garden tools on, your extension cords. We have, how many kids have basketballs? Totally, and yeah. That you can just put that in there, instead of it rolling around all over the place, you have a place for that. Now in terms of everything that we have over here on the table, where's the best place to get it? Because if people can't come into the store, can they go online? They can go online to citymail.com. Of course, you can visit us at any of our eight locations. All right, come down and check it out. It is a new year. Get clean, get organized. We'll have all this up at highnowdaily.com.